2024 and as you can see here I am where the picture was taken in Grindon and again it's freezing I'm gonna have a warm video one of these days I promise you but at the moment it's blowing a gale it's the end of March the dafts are up early as everything seems to be early this year um, but come the 1st of April this view should look pretty much as it did in the calendar which is what I intended uh, anyway enough of me in the view I'll swap around and you can have a look at what we're looking at Well, here we are in Grindon at All Saints Church and this is quite a wide lens on this phone and as you can see from the view it's, it's quite a large view to turn it compass into one shot. Uh, the picture in the calendar is made up of a number of shots stitched together to get the super wide effect to get the whole church and all the daffodils in. Uh, it's something I do quite a lot. I'll put up a picture of uh, the calendar picture without the, the cropping so you can see roughly where all the frame edges are. Uh, it, it was uh, quite a large shot. I think it was made up of nine photos in all. So starting off over there and then shooting across to about there but uh, I'll have a wander around the churchyard I love old churchyards um, it's a bit of a chilly day for being hanging around them and there's nobody about apart from the birds Grindon is such a cute little village not much going on but uh, a very, a very nice example of a, a proper moorland village but with a fabulous church I've decided to give up trying to record sound on the day it was just getting windier and windier uh, much better to sit here in a nice warm office and do a bit of a voiceover the church is beautiful uh, and it's one of the outstanding features of the village and of the area. In this shot taken up on the moors you can see both Butterton and Grindon churches, Grindon in the background, and they stand out beautifully. It's amazing to see such a, a massive building um, in such a little village. Uh, there must have been some money about at some point. Uh, a lot of familiar family names in the graveyard as well. Uh, I went to school with people with very similar surnames so they don't travel far in this area. All in all, it's a beautiful little spot to visit. Uh, the whole of that area of the moorlands is, is absolutely beautiful. And I don't get out of there as much as I should, really. And this is the view from the back of the church. Uh, it's quite stunning, really. Well, I hope you've enjoyed the video, and I will see you for May's video. Have a lovely month. Bye-bye.